Good evening, Maricela. Good evening, me escucha. Yes, I can hear you. How are you? Hi, fine. Very good. How was your day? ¿Qué tal su día? Mm, I very much working. Así será. <laughs> very busy. Very busy working. That's fine. Uh, busy. Busy, ocupada. Ah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. What do you do, Maricela? ¿A qué se dedica? Mm, yo soy maestra, pero oh. este, ahorita por la pandemia me quedé desempleada. Entonces me he quedado eh, con una tienda en línea que tengo. Oh, that's nice. You got your own business. Tiene su propio negocio. Qué bien. Sí, así es. Mm -hmm. That's great. Maricela estaba Le viendo. Mandé a WhatsApp, este... Sí, sí, sí. Hasta este momento lo acabo de, de ver ahí medio. No sé si le puedo ayudar siempre en Ajá. algo. Dígame. ¿Qué es lo yo que lo necesita? Sí, porque ya no hay que poner. No sé si yo lo he escrito mal Ajá. o este o es otra la respuesta porque Ajá. ya no hay que poner. 5.13 si quieres, revisamos. A ver. Ahorita voy a ver. Ajá. Hay un audio en, en 5.13, uh -huh. si no mal recuerdo. Yes. So let me check. Okay, acá podríamos hacer la oración de esta forma, con la forma contractada, she's driving. Um, utilizando el punto o sin utilizarlo. También podemos poner la forma completa, la forma larga. She is driving. Y de igual forma se podría utilizar solamente la acción, driving. No sé si gusta intentar de nuevo, Marisela, pero veo que así me había escrito las respuestas. No sé qué será lo que le está fallando. Así está escrito. Tienes razón, a lo mejor algún punto Ajá. y quiero ver la algún segunda. espacio, perdón. A lo mejor Ajá. algún espacio que le que haya dejado, me imagino. Ah, que la antes, segunda quizás. está. Swimming, swimming is double M. En swimming es que si estoy intentando que... eso. Uh -huh. Ah. Sí, yo igual quien le puse. Ah, ok. That one is swimming. Sí, debería de intentar Ajá. nuevamente. ¿Y la cuatro qué es? Porque... Number four is watching television. Ah, y yo como estaba como pasando, le puse el listen to music. Entonces, mm -hmm. este, voy a volver a intentar el, la okay. uno, que sí es la única que está buena, ¿verdad? Las otras sí las tenía malas, las otras dos. Mm -hmm. Y a ver qué es lo que pasa. Yes, try again and let me know. Vale, está bien. Gracias. Me avisa cualquier cosa. Ok. Vaya, vale, está bien. Gracias. Good evening, mi day. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Good. And you? I'm pretty well. Thanks for asking. How was your day? ¿Qué tal su día? 
It's nice. Okay, that's good. Very good. And tell me about the platform. How are you doing with that? Oh, ya me había dicho que ya terminó, ¿verdad? Con el trabajo en plataforma, ¿cierto? Uh -huh. Sí. Sí, ya. Yeah, I remember. Okay, perfect. Bueno. Good evening, Christian. Good evening, Miss. How are you? I'm fine, and you? I'm doing pretty well. Thanks for asking. How was your day? It's a good day. It was a good one. Okay, I'm glad to know that. Excuse me? I'm glad to know that, me alegra. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> In the platform, Christian, have you finished? Yes, I finished. Oh, you're done with everything. Did you get your diploma already? Yes, I have. Okay, okay. all right, that's nice. Congratulations. Thanks. Okay, do we have any questions, any doubts um, in, about the topics that we have been studying? No sé si tenemos alguna consultita de alguno de los temas que estamos viendo. Any doubts? Not really. So we may start now. Let me see. So welcome everybody. Today we are going to talk a little bit about the time. Vamos a hablar de la hora, de cómo expresarla. So first of all, we, we need to know the question that we make. That one is, what time is it? La pregunta que hacemos es, what time is it? ¿Qué hora es? What time is it? Repeat, please. What time, what is, time, it? Is, what it? time is it? What time is it? Say it again. What time is it? What time, what time is, it? is it? Okay. And then let me tell you about some of the expressions we use in order to express the time. In order to say the time, we got o'clock, que significa en punto. For example, when we say three o'clock, it's three o'clock, son las tres en punto. It's five o'clock, over here, son las cinco en punto. And it's 12 o'clock, son las doce en punto. O en este caso de las doce, podría ser it's noon. Eh, así como lo veíamos ayer en el video, también podríamos expresar las 12 del mediodía como noon, it's noon, or midnight, if it's at night, it's midnight, es la medianoche, right? Then we got the expression O. Oh. Esta la vamos a utilizar cuando tengamos horarios así, que van del minuto 1 al minuto 9. Entonces decimos, it's 10.05, it's 10.05, or it's 4.06, it's 4.06, it's 9.08. Este cero lo leemos como O, it's 9.08. Then we also have AM and PM. También tenemos las expresiones, al igual que en español, AM y PM, AM and PM. And we got, oh, we got this times. It's 10.40 a.m. It's 7 p.m. And it's 9.10 a.m. Now I need you to repeat. O'clock. 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 It's 3 o'clock. It, it's 3 o'clock. It's 5 o'clock. It's five o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. It's five o'clock. It's 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. Oh. 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 It's 10.05. Oh. 
It's ten o five. It's ten o five. It's four o six. It's four o six. It's nine o eight. It's nine o eight. Okay, now say a m. A m. P m. P m. It's ten forty a m. It's ten forty a m. It's seven p m. It's seven p m. It's nine ten a m. It's nine ten p m. A m. Repeat please. A m. A m. Very good. Okay. It's now. A m. Now, some other expressions that we can use. We have past in two. And again, we got o'clock, which would be in punto. Then we have. For example, when we say it's two o'clock, right? Then we also have in a quarter or a quarter past. Acá, al igual que en español, podemos decir y cuarto. Cuando sea una hora determinada y quince minutos, decimos in a quarter y un cuarto o y cuarto. A quarter past es otra forma de decirlo. Here I have some examples. Um, 4.15, it's 4.15. Or you could say it's a quarter past four. It's four in a quarter. Then we have in a half, half past y media. Cuando tenemos una hora terminada con 30 minutos, decimos in a half or half past. It's half past one. It's half past one. It's 1.30. It's one and a half. Then we also have the expression two, for example, in this, we would say it's 20 to four, it's 20 to four, or it's 340. Another important expression is a quarter to, un cuarto para. For example, here it's a quarter to 10, it's a quarter to 10, or it's 9.45. It's 9.45. So please repeat, o'clock. O'clock. Past. O'clock. Past. Two. 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 Five. And in a quarter. And a quarter. A quarter past. In a quarter. A quarter past. In a half. A quarter past. And a half. Half past. Half past. A quarter two. A quarter two. Very good. Okay, now it's time to practice. I'm going to send you to the breakout rooms for a couple of minutes. And I want you to practice by asking and telling the time. So here, for example, you would say, what time is it? It's nine o'clock. It's nine, you could also add a.m. or p.m. maybe, or in the morning, in the evening, and so on, right? So let me send you to the breakout rooms right now, and I'll send you a picture to the WhatsApp group. Los voy a mandar entonces a los grupos pequeños para que practiquemos diciendo las horas que acá les tengo. Tratemos de utilizar distintas opciones, por ejemplo, acá it's 4.30, it's four and a half, and so on. Todas las opciones que se les ocurran para ir practicando. Y les voy a mandar yo la foto al WhatsApp, al grupo de WhatsApp, para que tengan todas las horas y puedan practicar, ¿ok? All right, so there you go. Accept the invitation, please.
No, y la muchacha ahí, Midei. Ah, Midei está también. Ah, yo creo que ya mandó la foto, la mí. Sí. In iniciamos. Yo no sé si yo lo tengo mal el internet. No yo escucho. tampoco no escucho, no escucho bien tampoco. Ah, pues todos lo tenemos mal. Sí, no sé yo creo que mi day le está fallando. Ah. Porque a mí me escucha bien, si no me equivoco. Sí, a usted lo escucho bien y usted me escucha a mí. Sí, sí igual. A, a mi day. Ah, pues igual. a mi day le está fallando. Ajá. Desde la tarde Ay. está malísimo. Sí, es que a veces le agarra esto. Bueno, iniciemos con las nueve de la ma las nueve, dijo, ¿verdad? Si quieren, ah, vamos uno y uno. Sí. Okay. Okay. Espérame, que no me... Si quiere, empiece usted, Enrique, está más fácil el de las nueve, en punto. Solo va a decir o'clock. Ah, gracias, gracias. Este, nine o'clock. Pero no Ajá. era primero la, la pregunta. Six. What time is it? Nine o'clock. It's nine o'clock. It's nine o'clock. Ajá, it's... Y la otra forma que puede ser a MPM o del día, de la mañana y de la noche. Ah, entonces que le agregue allí. Ajá, agregue. Ajá. X night o'clock y AM o PM. Entonces la de. La de las cuatro y media sería It's four eh, Triste ¿Cómo se dice? Ferry Hola Ferry Eva It's four Ferry uh -huh. Y otra It's forma Ferry Ajá, otra forma Para Es que la es cuando se dice como media, ¿verdad? Ajá, la media sería. Uh -huh. ¿Lo anotó? No, permítame. Bueno, es half past. Entonces es. Sería x half past for. Es half past four. Serían las cuatro y media. Uh -huh. Bye. Sería como otra forma. Creo que también otra forma puede ser x, x, seri, minus, past four. Son 30 minutos pasadas las cuatro. That's right. Es correcto. Yes. Bye. So you could also say it's 30 minutes after four. After four. Uh -huh. En vez de pa past. y after también se puede utilizar. Ah, se pueden los dos. Sí. Ah, ok. Perdón, puede repetir este, lo del pasado a las cuatro. No escuché muy bien. Sería X. Y seri, minus, 30 minutos, uh -huh. past, past, for, o after, for, dice la misma. De las dos puede ser past o after. Uh -huh. Ajá, past, pasadas, o after, después. Uh -huh. Is for, past, past, for, for. Uh -huh. for. O puede ser after. For. After ah, four. Sí. Uh -huh. Se puede de, de cuatro formas hicimos eso, ¿verdad? Ajá. Entonces Ahí continuaría vamos. yo con. No voy yo con la segunda, con la tercera, ¿verdad? La de las dos y cincuenta y cinco. Okay. X to 55 
PM. O X2 55 uh -huh, AM. Eh, también podría ser X, X 55 after 2. Son 55 pasadas. No, X 55 uh -huh, minus past 2. Pasada las 2. 55 minutos pasada a las 2. Quiero ver otra forma. Ah, este. Sí. Y... Para, es para. Sería. If it's five. And three. Pa, pa, que faltan para las tres, cinco minutos. Eso falta. Ajá. Minutos. X, five Ajá. minutes. Eh, X, five minutes. Or... Ahí utilizamos two. Three. Two es. Es oro two. 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 Uh -huh. X, X, five minutes, two. Three, así. Exacto. Ah, bye. Okay. Yo creo que así como esta, solo con estas dos, creo que estaría bien. También. Pasaremos a la otra. Pero no decimos la versión completa o las horas, pero bueno, es lo que. Entonces lo, lo podemos decir de dos maneras. Podemos decir si it's six six no tendría que ser tir eh, a ver tirting pas six Ajá. No, sería Ajá, Ajá, para eso sería if 35 past 6. ¿Qué sería pasan de las 35 minutos de las 6? 5. Oh, ¿Cuál dice usted? La 5 y 8. Ah, sí, 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 35. Ajá. No, sí, sí, en esa. Ah, va. 6 y 35 estamos. Ajá. Uh -huh. Otra serie ahí. Sí. 6, uh -huh. um, 255. X6, 235, que diga. No, pero 55. Es 55. No, 30. Yo sabía que no la pronuncio bien, entonces. Yo sé, 35. 30, 35. ¿Cómo? Miss. It's Ajá, 35. Sí, 35. Ajá, 30, 35. 30, 35. 35. 35. Entonces sería uh -huh. 35. 35 pass 6. Six. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. O sea, 35 pasadas las 6. 35 pas 6. Sí, correcto. La otra sería... La otra. Sería... 6. 6. 6. 35. Sí, está bien. Vaya, vamos a la otra. La otra sería 847. Uh -huh. Sería 8 e Take to 47. It's 8 to 47. It's, you say it's 847 only. It's Okay, it's 8.47. Oh, maybe Anna is having trouble with her internet, I think. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. Anna, can you hear us? Yeah, she's having trouble. She's, she's gone. Thank you. 
Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. So uh, you could continue practicing with me. So we got, for example, okay. in letter G, it's 847. Or uh -huh. it could be another option. Oh, hi, Anna. It's 47 past eight. Exactly. 47 past eight. Mm -hmm. 47. 47 past eight. E Y también podríamos decir A47. Exactly. Sí. Correcto. Bueno. La Vamos otra sería. Otra. Entonces, dos sería. Okay, so let me hear you telling the time. Let's see, Midei, letter A, what time is it? 9 o'clock a.m. Okay, that's fine. It's nine o'clock, you say, very good. Christian, letter B, please, what time is it? It's 40 is 4 30. 4 30. Do you have any other option we could use there? 4 half past. Okay, in that case, you say half past 4. Half past 4, okay. Or it's 4 and a half. Okay. Thanks, Christian. Ana Baños, letter C, what time is it? It is 2.55. Okay. Any other option? Uh, or... or 55. Pass two. Very good. Or we could also consider saying it's five to three, two, three. It's five to three. Faltan cinco para las tres. Okay, okay, uh -huh. okay. Very good, Ana. Maricela, it's your turn. What time is it? It's two or 15. Two fifteen? Uh-huh. It's two fifteen. Mm -hmm. okay. It's a uh, fifteen minutes past two. Fifteen minutes past two. That's right. I creo que hay otra. Okay, tell me. Ah, que sería usando el cuar. It's it's este it's a quarter past two. That's right. It's a quarter past two. Or mm -hmm. it's two and a quarter. Very good, Maricela. Enrique, what time is it? La F sería, si no, no. Letter E. No, la O. Ah. Over here. Sería, it's five eight. Five eight. PM, y la otra forma. It's eight minutes past five. Very good, Enrique. Sí, no and we could also say it's 5.08. Just remember, whenever we have a zero over here, 
we pronounce it or we read it as O, 508. Thanks for participating, Enrique. Very good. Okay, next one, midday. What time is it? It's 6 35. Okay. O'clock. No, verdad, o'clock. No, in that perdón. case, you do not say o'clock. <laughs> Y, y la otra opción sería is thirty eh, perdón sí x thirty five million packs pass six very good mide Maricela next one please what time is it x a forty seven o forty seven it's 47 minutes after eight. Okay. And, uh -huh, and it's, it's 23 or nine. Está bien esa. That one would be, let's see, um, 13 minutes. 13 minutes to nine. Solamente que son Ajá. tres de los que faltan. Me. 13, Ay, sí, sí, sí. Nine. Uh -huh. sí, sí. Yeah, that's good. Thank you, Maricela. Enrique, next one, please. What time is it? Yeah, it's two, two. <laughs> me, me cuesta pronunciar el 12. 12. 12. 12. 12. 22. Okay. Eh, el, el otro que sería 23 and minimum pass eh, 12. Eh, 12. Ok, thanks Enrique. Next one, Christian, what time is it? It's 10 50 35. Okay. It's 35 past 10. Yes. Um, it's 25 to 11. Excellent, Christian. Ana Baños, what time is it? Past 11. Very good, 11. Anna. 11. Okay. Yes, again, remember that whenever we have a zero here, we want to, we are going to read it as O. So that would be 1104 or 508. Just remember all that detail, please. Okay, so now let's continue by reviewing some vocabulary. Now we have a new lesson objective, which is by the end of this class, you will be able to ask and answer present continuous WH questions. Oh, just before we get to the WH questions, we're going to review some vocabulary from the platform. Let me get it. Over here. So we're going to listen to some different vocabulary for talking about activities that we do on a daily basis. <clears throat> or things that we usually do. Okay, so here we are. I needed to pay attention to the video. 
this class you'll become familiar with vocabulary in order to express activities. Let's start by listening and repeating. He's playing tennis. He's riding a bike. She's running. He's swimming. She's taking a walk. They're so, dancing. She's driving. They're going to the movies. He's shopping. She's reading. She's studying. He's watching television. Now, your task is to describe the actions from the picture. Okay, I need you to repeat after me. Play tennis. Play tennis. Play tennis. Play tennis. Playing tennis. Play Play tennis. Ride a bike. Ride a bike. Riding a bike. Riding a bike. Run. Run. Running. Running. Swim. Swimming. 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 Take a walk. Take a walk. Taking a walk. Taking a walk. Dance. 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 Dancing. 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 Drive. 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 Driving. 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 Go to the movies. Go to the Go movies. To the movies. Going to the movies. Going to, Going to the, movies. the movies. Shop. 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 Shopping. 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 Read. 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 Reading. 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 Study. 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 Studying. 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 Watch television. Watching television. Watching television. Watching television. Okay, just remember that um, in order to use these activities in a present continuous sentence, we would need to change them to the ing form, right? For example, in the case of write, we would have writing. And also remember that in the case of the verb run, we need to double the N and we got running. For swim, we got swimming with double M. Swimming. Then over here, take becomes taken. Dance becomes dancing. Drive becomes driving. And also shop takes double, oh, let me just fix this. We got here driving, then shop needs a double P. It becomes shopping. And then for the others, we only add ING. Esos serían los que cambian. Recuérdense que los verbos que terminan en E, Se les quita la E y luego se les agrega ING. Hay algunos verbos también que van a llevar doble consonante. Se, se duplica la última consonante. Por ejemplo, en run, running, llevaría doble N. Swim, swimming, llevaría, llevaría doble M. Y en shop también necesitamos doble P. Then for all the others, we only add ing. Para las demás, simplemente agregamos ing, como en playing, going. We also have watching. Studying. And also reading. That will be it. So now I am going to give you a chance to practice by making some sentences using the activities over here. We're going to make some sentences 
in the present continuous. Vamos a hacer oraciones utilizando el present continuous. So let me see. Midei, can you make a sentence using playing tennis? Um, este, podemos, George, okay. playing tennis. George, George, is, George playing. is playing tennis. Uh -huh. Very good, Midei. Enrique, make a sentence using riding a bike. Mm. Yeah, I am riding a, a bike. Excellent. Maricela, make a sentence using running. Um, Josué is running in the park. Is running in the park. Okay, very good. Christian, make one using swimming. He is swimming in the park. He is swimming in the, well, in that case, we could say in the pool, for instance. In the pool. Uh -huh. In the pool, sería a piscina. Let me write it here for you. So, for example, in the case of swimming, we could say in the pool or in the lake, in the sea as well. In la piscina, in el lago, in el mar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, Christian, say it. She is in the pool. She is swimming in the pool. Very good. She's swimming in the pool. Anna, can you make a sentence using taking a walk? She, she is a taking. She is. She is taking a walk. She is taking a walk. Okay, very good. Now, Midei, make a sentence using dancing. They are dancing. They are dancing, okay. Maricela, next one using driving. She is driving in the house. Driving? In the house. Okay. Oh, for the house. In, what do you want to say? ¿Qué, ¿Qué es lo que queremos decir exactamente? Para la casa. Oh, to her house. To. Mm. Yes, okay. or we could also say she's to the house. home. She's driving home. Como va para la casa. Uh -huh. Is driving to house. To her house. Yes, that's right, Maricela. Anna, make one using going to the movies. They they going to the movies. They're going to the movies. Okay, very good. Christian, make one using shopping. He is shopping in the supermarket. Great. Enrique, reading. Enrique, take your microphone, please. Sería, they have a book and read. Okay, do you say they're reading a book, maybe? Or you could make two different sentences. They are reading a book, o en ese caso podríamos hacer dos oraciones distintas. They have a book and they are reading. Serían dos, they have a book y luego they are reading. They have a book and they are reading. That could be an option too, okay, very good. Maricela, make one using studying. He is studying the English class. Okay, nice. Give me the one last one using watching television. 
My father watch watch tele television. Watching television. My father is watching television. Okay, excellent. Let's repeat them one last time. Please repeat after me. Playing tennis. Playing tennis. Playing tennis. Playing tennis. Playing tennis. Riding a bike. Riding, Riding a bike. A bike. Running. 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 Swimming. 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 Taking a walk. Taking a walk. Taking a walk. Dancing. 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 Driving. 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 Going to the movies. Going, Going to, the to the movies. Shopping. 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 Reading. 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 Studying. 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 Watching. 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 Okay, now let's continue by listening um well by watching this video about the present continuous wh questions so let me just get it okay i need you to pay attention In this class, you'll learn to ask and answer present continuous questions. Additionally, we will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation between a boy and his mother, which illustrates WH questions in context. Let's listen and practice. Hi, Mom. What are you doing, Steve? I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Now, let's try. Okay, so I want you to look at the conversation and tell me if you have any questions about it. Tenemos preguntas de la conversación, tal vez alguna palabra nueva. Do you understand the meaning of hungry? We're here, hungry. Hambriento. Exactly. Okay. So now I need you to repeat after me. Hi, mom. Hi, mom. Hi, mom. What are you doing, Steve? What are you doing, Steve? What are you doing, Steve? I'm cooking. I am I'm cooking. cooking. I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? Why, Why are you are cooking you now? now? It's two o'clock in the morning. It's two, two o'clock in, in the morning. In the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. Well, well I'm hungry. hungry. What are you making? What are you making? What are you making? Pizza. Pizza. Mm. Pizza. Mm. Pizza. Pizza. Mm. Now I'm getting hungry. No, I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Let's, let's eat. eat. Okay, let me ask Maricela and Christian to read the conversation, please. Christian, you start. Hi, mom. Hi, mom. Oh. Where are you doing, Steven? I cooking. Where are you cooking now? 
It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. Where are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. No, I am getting hungry. Let's eat. Very good. Thank you, Christian and Maricela. Now, Enrique and Ana, can you read it, please? Enrique, okay. you start. Empiezo yo o en o el. Enrique. Thank you. Enrique, go ahead, please. Maybe he's having trouble. Let's see. Enrique, can you hear us? Okay. Yes. Hi, Mom. What, what are you doing, Steve? I am cooking. Why are you cooking now? It is two o'clock yes. in the morning. Well, I am really hungry. What are you making? Continue, Enrique. Yeah, maybe he's having trouble. So pizza. Continue. Mm. Mm, pizza. Now I getting hungry. Let's eat. Okay, very well. Thanks for reading, Enrique and Anna. And Midei, let me read the last time with you. So let me start. Hi, mom. What are you doing, Steven? I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mm, pizza. Now I am great, great hungry. Let's eat. All right. Very good, Mide. Now I need you to repeat, please, everybody. I'm... I'm, 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 cooking, 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 doing, 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 doing. o'clock, doing, o'clock, in the morning, in the morning, in the morning, really, 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 really. Hungry. Hungry. hungry, 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 hungry. hungry. Making, 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 getting, 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 getting. Let's, 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 let's. Okay, now we're going to continue watching the video. I need you to pay attention. Uh, now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Now let's try to make sense of present continuous WH questions. We will typically use present continuous WH questions whenever we want to get information from an action that is in progress. For example, what are you doing right now? To form WH questions, we need to follow this formula. WH word plus verb to be plus subject plus the verb plus ing plus some kind of complement. If we look at the images on the screen, you can see a few WH questions. Let's analyze the first one. What's Victoria doing? We have a WH word, what. Then we have the verb to be, is. After that, we have the subject, 
Victoria. After that, we have the uh, verb in its ing form. And then we have a question mark. Then, of course, you can see the question being answered. She's sleeping now. Now, we're going to listen to the rest of the questions and answers. Let's listen and repeat. Los Angeles, 4 a.m. What's Victoria doing? She's sleeping right now. Repeat, please. What's Victoria doing? What's Victoria, What's Victoria, doing? Victoria doing? She's sleeping right now. She's, She's sleeping, sleeping right, right, now. right now. Mexico City, 6 a.m. What's Marcos doing? It's 6 a.m., so he's getting up. What's Marcos doing? What's Marcos doing? It's 6 a.m., so he's getting up. It's 6 a.m. It's 6 a.m. He's going on. New York City, 7 a.m. What are Sue and Tom doing? They're having breakfast. What are Sue and Tom doing? Repeat, please. What are what? What are Tom and Tom doing? What are Sue and doing? Repeat, doing. 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 They're having breakfast. They're, They're having, having breakfast. breakfast. Okay, so because of the time, we are going to stop over here and we are going to continue with the WH questions tomorrow. Take care. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.